Hey, what's up, guys? It's your boy, uh, so cool back again with another video. I said last video 30 views and 10 likes for part 2. This isn't a part 2, but more or less another random story of dumb kids doing what they do best. Three guesses on what it is. Yeah, that's right, being dumb. Who figured? Anyways, guys, that's it for the intro. Let's hop right into the video. So basically, in year two, I got switched between classes in the middle of the school year. The class that I went was sent to was, um, what's the word? A lively, to put in a polite tone. However, the center of attention were two kids who I'm going to name Matt and Jaden. Both of these guys were actual jerks. Now, the center of attention, like the main part of the story, the, the story that revolves around him, is uh, Matt, because uh, Jaden was just as, like, um, let's just say he was like, like what Robin is to Batman, like he's like he like the the guy there, like the guy in the like the background, he's like always supporting him. So yeah, let's get let's get into the video. Yeah, let's go, bro. I, like this is like the it's max the climax, school, okay? So at the like end of the year, and yet to the situation got so westward. He did he did something like really stupid, okay? He got screamed at, okay? The discipline the discipline coordinator was like going to the class, like take this guy away, like um like the like the usual teasing, you know, guys. Um, as um he and this other crackhead ran into the back of the classroom, and then they're like slippers that we. Usually yeah, like, made will do it's like an assignment thing, okay? Remember, this dude, is a private um, school, okay? And it was, and I swear it was like D Day, bro. They began chucking them, like, literally at the teacher, bro. The teacher's glasses came off, bro. It was, it was actual panic, bro. Okay, so teachers were brought in from like all the other classes. I'm sure they had like a chat about it later. Like, oh my god, how did you feel? Like, oh, my class was so excellent. I mean, and they did not get conscious very quietly. It was like I could just scroll through Instagram DMs. Um, my class, um, there's these two crackheads, uh, they started chucking slippers at me. Don't even ask how the rest of my day went. Um, yeah, that was like the climax of the story. We never saw them all, uh, again for the rest of uh, year two. Because just fell out of a nest. Bro, go to hell, bro. In year two, along with everything this um actual retard did, so he basically um decided that the best thing to do to um buy a cupcake from the canteen was to steal our teacher's purse. Uh, I'm not saying that the teacher was good, and I'm not, I'm not giving my opinion on things, but um, this actual idiot, he had been in like he had been in like the like the cupboard where like the teacher kept her like stuff for like um, so she kept it there until like the end of the day, like a billion times to like take to take like coloring pens and that crap out of out of out in and out of there, yeah. So there were like cameras in our school because it was like a primary school, right? They had like cameras at all angles that were like 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 they were set there for the for those specific reasons. <laughs> bro, the guy got caught so bad, his, like, parents were cold. But the teacher... Bro, I, like, this is, like, the max climax, okay? So, at the end of the year, in year two, the situation got so worse, bro. He did, he, he did something, like, really stupid, okay? He got screamed at, okay? The, dis the discipline coordinator was, like, brought into the class to, like, take this guy away. Like, um, like, the, like the usual teaser, you know, guys? Um, as, um, he and this other crackhead ran into the back of the classroom, and then they're like slippers that we use when we made wudu, it's like an Islamic thing, okay, remember this is a private school, okay, and it was, and I swear it was like D-Day, bro, they began chucking them, like, literally at the teacher, bro, the teacher's glasses came off, bro, it was, it was actual panic, bro. Okay, so teachers were brought in from like all the other classes. I'm sure they had like a chat about it later. Like, oh my god, how did you choose? Like, oh, my class was so excellent. I mean, and they did like the conscious really quietly. It was like I could just scroll through Instagram DMs. Um, my class, um, there's these two crackheads. Uh, they started chucking slippers at me. Don't even ask how the rest of my day went. Um, yeah, that was like the climax of the story. We never saw them uh, again for the rest of uh, year two. And after that, um, incident, so to say, I don't know if you could call it an incident, so he was, like, moved to the other, to another class, because we had, we were, like, a private school, right, so we had, like, three different classes for year two, one who was a high class, the other one was a middle, and the, and the last one was, like, a low class, it was just to see, like, how fast, like, you could, like, I don't know, memorize stuff, that's what you do in school anyways, so he was moved to another class, and we never saw him for, like, the rest of the year. No, maybe, yeah, yeah, um, um, this guy changed when he grew up. No, shut up. No, he didn't. Now, thinking about all these memories brings up a new one that I just remembered, okay? <laughs> uh, I remember, like, yeah, I remember, like, it was yesterday, bro. This actual idiot stole, like, $20 from a kid, okay? And, get and like, year four, okay? So, we were in year four, and, like, supposedly, the rumor was that no other teacher, except for, like, our teacher that we had, she was a South African, she was really nice, she gave us lots of free time and free food and stuff. She was, a, she was a very chill teacher, okay? So, um, this actual idiot stole $20 from a kid's bag, okay? And guess what? The teacher spent, like, three periods, okay? Which is, like, like half the school day trying to figure out who did it, okay? And this guy, the teacher would have not, like, ever found out. But this idiot, like, this actual idiot made up, like, a story 
okay, and then blame someone else, change the story, then he, this went on, like, repeat, and then the teacher finally caught on, okay, the teacher was got, like, really suspicious, he, she, like, interrogated him during recess time, okay, bro, it, it was really crazy, the teacher made us, like, pull out our bags and then, um, empty all the zips, take all our homework out, bro, kids got busted, like, before not doing their homework and stuff, it was hilarious, bro, so the kid, he got busted, he was, like, he, he had, like, this little diary that he used to write in, like, it was my, my little self-improvement journal, bro, Sh shut up, nobody likes you, man, so the guy got busted so bad, bro, bro, like I mentioned before, this guy was also, like, really physical, I remember this one, this, this guy punched me in the face in, um, when we were, we, we, okay, so basically the story was, we were late to, um, to play soccer, so the other classes took the goals, okay? So we're just standing there, no joke. He, he, we, so he had, like, no ball, okay? He said he was just gonna hang out there and be cool, unlike the rest of us. So we're just, like, standing there, no joke, okay? So we asked him to move, okay? We, we didn't do anything else, okay? We, we didn't swear, we didn't swear, we didn't, cur we didn't cuss. We didn't um, insult his entire family, unlike um, some CSGO gamers. Um, so we asked him, like, so we asked him politely to move. Okay, and then this guy, for no reason whatsoever, okay, he, this guy punched me in the face. Like, actually punched me in the face, bro. Yeah, the thing was, I, I don't really give two craps about to punch the man, but the thing was, I had, like, an infection in my cheeks, so it was, like, really sw swollen. This idiot, this actual crackhead, I hope you're hearing this right now, this guy, this actual crackhead made it, like, 200 times worse. Oh, my days, bro. I, I don't know what his parents are doing with him. So, um, I'm pretty sure his, his, his family, he got, like, suspended for three days. His family friend told me that he was, like, banned for playing games for the, um, for the rest of the time he was in, like, school. So, um, sucks to be you, man. Sucks to be you. Come 1v1 me. When I, I'm all grown up now. I'm very muscular. I'm totally Giga Chad. I really didn't know what was up with the kid, why he was so aggressive and annoying. Whatever, that's not my problem anymore. By the way, after the moron punch, we did get banned from playing video games, so um, take the big fat L loser. Anyway, guys, that's going to end it for this video. I'm going on the grind. I have like 20 stories I want to tell before I, I go for vacation. Uh, <laughs> like I'm a big YouTuber or some crap. Um, Yeah, that's that. Anyways, guys, that's going to end it for this video. If you guys have any suggestions, leave them in the comment section down below. I'm trying to reach 100 subs by the end of the year, so please, please subscribe and help me out. That's it from me. It's your so cool here. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share the video with your friends, family, and your dogs. Um, yeah, it's your so cool here, and see you in the next one. Bye.